world is infatuated with watching people open up storage units that they bid on. And so often they find guns in those storage units. People love to watch people find guns in storage units for some reason. But it happens so much that there's plenty of entertainment so, for them. So I want to kind of answer the question, should you store guns in a storage unit or a storage locker? Now, before I get into it, I do want to take a moment and thank our sponsor, Victory Chrysler Dodge Jeep Ram, for not only supporting our channel, but being the hands and feet of Jesus Christ by having ministries like food pantries, serving hot meals all over this country, building orphanages all over this world, battered women's shelters all over this country. Uh, so I'm going to put their link below. Check them out. Click that link. Go check out their Giving Hope Fund, which will tell you about their ministries. If they have a ministry in your hometown, uh, I recommend you buy a car from them. They can ship it to you anywhere in this country, uh, potentially in the world, if, <laughs> if you work with them quite the right way, I guess. But that way the money goes into the ministry in your hometown and not into somebody's pocket. So that link is below. My kids have always loved to watch that show, Storage Wars. And apparently the rest of the world does too. Um, and even through TikToks and YouTubes, people just love seeing what's inside those things when they auction them off. Now, personally, I am surprised how many times that people go into those things and they find guns. So I want to kind of talk about, you know, well, should you store guns in storage lockers? Well, I guess the answer is no. <laughs> of course you shouldn't store guns in storage lockers for several reasons. Number one, it could get robbed. Uh, number two, uh, you could lose track of it. You could maybe find yourself in a financial situation where you can't pay the bill and now you just lost your guns. Uh, why should you owe somebody else money for your guns? Now, I also want to kind of say to that, that where I believe your guns should be all the time is in a safe in your home or on you personally. That's it. Like that is it. Uh, the only exception would be in a safe that's sealed to the structure of your car inside your car. Like if you have to go inside a, a place where you can't bring your gun with you. But that would be it. You know, don't leave your guns in a storage locker. That's so foolish. Like every time I see that, I think, what idiots, man? What kind of idiot did that? Uh, you know, who would do such a foolish thing? So what's the consequences of your guns getting stolen? Well, uh, or picked up by somebody off of a bid in an auction, you know, buying your thousands of dollars worth of guns for a hundred bucks kind of thing. But the big problem is then your serial numbers are out in the world. And if somebody commits a crime with that gun, ultimately that's for sure 100% coming back to you because they do reverse tracing. Um, you know, if that gun is found in a crime, uh, they go to the producer of it who tells them which distributor they sold it to, who tells them which gun store they sold it to, which then gives them your name and address. And then you're out there. You know, then some suddenly ATF or FBI or local police are banging on your door asking you where your gun is. So, you know, and the other piece is like, what if you pass away? You know, your kids aren't going to have access to that storage locker necessarily. You know, it's, it's just, I'd say the only exception to in a safe in your home or on your person, the only exception I would say to that would be like, if you have a really expensive gun, maybe in a safety deposit box, like a, like a collector, like, let's say you have George Washington's muskets or something. Obviously, I wouldn't keep those in safe in your house. You know, I'd put those in a safe deposit box. That'd be, really be about the only exception I'd have, you know? Um, any thoughts or insight? 
I'd love to hear it because in the end, man, don't put your guns in storage units or storage lockers. That's just, I mean, why pay somebody to keep track of your guns and risk losing them? Not some of them, all of them, risk losing them all. That's crazy talk. 